Okay, it's our last day at sea. I think I said that earlier. But we are on our way to the Adventure Ocean to go see a puppet show. Well, we did some slides this morning. The kids were in the play area. And then uh, <coughs> I did the Flow Rider, which I did awesome. Again, I got on my knees, no hands. And then I wiped that when I was trying to try to sit down, so. But anyways, um, so yeah, so we're getting ready to go up to the kids club. <coughs> so I just dropped off the kids at, um, at the daycare. Or not daycare, but kids club, ocean adventure, same thing. Just dropped them off and now I'm headed down to the room. I gotta get my sunglasses. Get eight. And then I'm gonna head over to the casino for a little bit. Marissa and Avery are watching the Greece show. It should be over here in about 20 minutes. game I'm gonna play. I have really, I like this Three Little Piggies game, but I might choose someone different right now. I don't know. I'm really bummed that it's our last day, but at the same time, it's like, you know, you can only do this so much before you get wanting wanting to get back to the day to day maybe that's just me but like I'm ready like I'm ready to be home I'm ready to go back to work and I know it sounds weird but you know vacation is fun but I think seven nights is probably just like one day or two days too long for us I think a five night is what works well for us the three night we the Disney one is way too fast maybe a four night would work but I think uh I think the seven nights is probably way too long, but um, I think about these YouTubers that we follow, like Kara and Nate or Trevin Chelsea, and they travel a lot. And if it's your day job, then that's what you do for a living. Then sure, I can see how I can see how it makes sense to uh, to do it, and you're making money off of you know doing these things. But if it's just uh, if it's just you traveling having fun you gotta earn money somehow so I don't know we're ready to get back to the US hey look at that adult area ahead whoa what what happened we only get we only got 30 minutes this trip but we're here this is the solarium adults only 18 plus.
them. It literally nice. Yeah. I've been watching videos all about it and it has that area right there. I know, right? Is there a pool down there? No. Alright, so we are currently uh, in the solarium on the Royal Caribbean Harmony of the Seas. And it's our last day at sea. We're uh, gonna get back into port tomorrow in Port Canaveral. But I wanted to, um, or actually, we wanted to take out a little bit of time and say thank you. We just got an email and said that we have reached over 100 subscribers. So, which is amazing to us because we didn't really think that we'd ever get 100 subscribers. We never. We weren't, we didn't do this channel with that intention, and so it's been very humbling to see. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I mean, that means that there's a hundred people out there somewhere in the world that enjoy watching our videos, mm -hmm. like what the content that we put in there. So, like Marissa said, originally this, uh, this channel started off as like a family home video source. Um, just a place where we can, you know, document all of our travels and just look back on and relive the memories. Harrison! Is that? Hey, buddy! Ariana, where's our room? Find their room? Which one is it? How do you know? Is that ours? Yeah. Are you sure? Yes. Why? How do you know? Is it because of the stickers? Yeah. Where are we going? Where are we going? Huh? Hey. Are you looking? Are you looking? Where are we going? Where are we going? Can we go to horses? Come on, let's go. Alright, so it's our last night here. We just got through having dinner, went on the carousel for a little bit. Uh, now they're gonna have a parade. Uh, we missed every other night, but we're gonna we're gonna make this one. So <laughs> Marissa scoped out some spots, and Harrison keep pulling this down. Hey, stop! Stop! Yeah. for you. Don't go. Don't go. Anyway, we're ready to get off the ship. We're really sad to go, but we're ready to get off the ship. But I will say this: I think the biggest thing that we were upset about was the biggest thing we were upset about was leaving our waiter Joseph. He was phenomenal. Joseph, if you're watching this, and Jackson, thanks a lot for everything. You were awesome. The best waiter we've ever had on a cruise ship. So um, we'll see you whenever you get to the next one.
Okay, last but not least. All right, guys, I think that is going to do it. If you look around, we are all packed. It is the night before we arrive in Port Canaveral. All of our bags are out there waiting for the porters to pick it up tonight. We're going to go to sleep here just a little bit. Everybody's getting crazy, and Harrison's getting into everything. So. <laughs> All right, so that's going to do it. So thanks a lot for watching this week. We hope to provide you with lots of information on Harmony of the Seas, the Royal Caribbean, Seven Night Cruise. You guys have a magical day. We'll catch you later. Bye. for you? Yes. That whole piece is just for you? No. Have my cake. You can share that. Okay, well here we'll get you next. Jealousy says what? Jealousy. Here. Okay, there you go. Yeah, so good. Oh, wow. He's just working. He's just working it. What? You see? You do this. And then... <laughs> what happens? That's not real magic, Joseph. Not real magic. <laughs> <laughs> Much only <funny> ones, okay? <laughs> See? How did it get in there? Look, it's in there. Yeah. Real magic. <laughs> so Avery, what did you try to do? You tried to buy a beer? She tried to buy uh, a beer. You tried to buy a beer with my band. And they wouldn't. And they wouldn't. They wouldn't let me do it. <coughs> Say bye bye. Say bye bye.